I'm from Somalia. I live in the Airways with the area 17 years now. I'm from Yemen. I live in Wales for a long time and I love that it's a little bit, a bit quiet. After the war began in Ukraine, the life story of our family is closely connected with one's wars. I'm from Somalia and I'm a young mother for two children. I came here when I was in my late teens from Pakistan. I kind of grew up here so I know my ways around. I love the beast. Because of my background I come from, I'm scared it's still here. And I love the bees and each other and good neighbor. Now in the future, if I can nurse, health nurse, like help kids, like a cares, I love to help my people. I work part time in a restaurant. Live, uh, living in London is like, um, I feel like a home because I don't feel get bored. And if I need help, I know where to go. You have to be thankful. Uh, we have um, always felt uh, the help and support of the people and organizations uh, in one's force. If you speak about century, it's mean your home. Without your support, our stay here will be very difficult. One's Force has always been a place that welcomes refugees. And if you look on our crest, we have these things over here. That is the tears of the ignorance. And this is where they were really received and welcome. Right now we have a global humanitarian crisis going on and Wandsworth is a place that is welcoming, that is safe and that's important that we put out that message that Wandsworth is a welcoming place. It doesn't matter who you are, where you're coming from, you have a place here in Wandsworth that you can call a home. Two things been built on, Irish, Gujarati Indian, African Caribbean, Pakistani Indian, Tamil, Labour. Without migrants, there would be no tooting. It is a time for rest to be recognised well as a borough of sanctuary. <laughs>